He's right there. And he is coming for me. I hope there's something else that's swimming over there. Yeah, I knew it. So I started drinking this water without paying attention to the label. <laughs> it's definitely salt water. So thirsty. Really, man? I think it's the big nose hunting the Rex. Got your back, buddy. Hey guys, welcome to Crawl Unchained for part two of my Spinosaurus Juvid Adult video. I don't believe there's a need for a long intro here. Most of you have already seen part one. If you haven't seen part one, I strongly encourage you to go back and watch part one before watching this one. The only thing I'm going to say before we jump into the action here is seriously guys, thanks so much for the continuous support that this series is getting. Every time I open up my YouTube, I've gained new subscribers and I have more comments to read and reply to. The love this series is getting is out of this world, so as long as you guys continue to spread the love, I'm going to keep this series going. So once again, thank you all so much for the continued support and a big warm welcome to everyone who subscribed to my channel recently. Now let's go straight into it because a lot of you have already expressed how much you can't wait to see part 2. So here it is, enjoy! I'm gonna go for clams now. Oh wow, <laughs> holy crap, Spino just swam past me like a huge one, way bigger than me. There you go. How did I miss that stack earlier? No idea. Oh, I hate that quest. Okay, no, it's not that bad. I just need to bring clams. Okay. I shall do that. Okay, so that's funny. There's clams right next to it. Oh, it's gonna take a lot. If one doesn't even give it one percent, it's like everybody needs to work on that. Like, I'm never gonna be done with this. It's never gonna give me the other quest. 
And I'm just earning marks. Like, why should I care about marks unless I want to change my skin, which I'm not ready to do anyways. I'm gonna go cancel that quest. I don't want. I don't want that quest. <laughs> this is ridiculous. There's a big sarco in the water now. He's right where I was heading to, and there's something online. I think it's a an aloe. Yeah, it's an aloe. But yeah, there's a sarco in the water. In the same direction I'm heading now. So I'm a little bit worried here. He's right there. Is coming for me. Yeah, I can't escape this. Wow, holy crap, how does he turn so well? <laughs> I can't do shit. I'm dying right there. was out turning me uh, uh, out swimming me <laughs> I couldn't do shit and yeah thinking back on that um, you know croc encounter I just I panicked I lost the ability to think during that fight when I saw how fast he was catching up to me and and how I couldn't outmaneuver him either it just um, it, it threw me completely off I <laughs> I just couldn't think. Oh shit, that's zero percent. So that's a hot spot then. I got a little bit out of it, but... Huh. Oh, there's something else that's swimming over there. Don't know what it is. Oh, it's not even a... S what? It's swimming really fast, so it is a swimmer. That's a conch, I think. That's a duck. That's two ducks. One of them is almost dead. something else swimming yeah I knew it Attack me? No. Okay. I think he's, they're just happy I killed the conk.
So I started drinking this water without paying attention to the label. <laughs> it's definitely salt water. Everything on that side was all at 0%, so I kind of had to... I mean, I was so thirsty. So I started drinking this and I saw the debuff. So I guess it's the equivalent of eating salt in Panjura. So I am going to get my water levels up to the top and then it's going to start going down for two minutes. So obviously I can't refill my water completely, but I can still sustain myself temporarily with this. Yeah, it's going down quite quickly. Okay, is there a way that I can travel? Okay, so I can follow this, go like that, and then enter here. I think that would be the best bet. That way I can just keep drinking. Looks like that debuff is actually going to dry me out completely. So I need to stay where there's water absolutely the whole time until I can find fresh water. I'm going to have to sustain myself with salt water <laughs> until I can find fresh water. It's kind of scary. Yeah, you can fill up on salt water, but then it gives you two minutes to live. That's it. So it's worse than eating salt. Way worse. Okay, let's swim for two minutes. <laughs> I'm still very unsure whether I'm going to survive this. Okay, so I'm a little bit dumb here. Huh, hang on. Yeah, okay. This here should be fresh water right there. So I'm going to go there. God, I hope that water's good. Yeah, okay. What's that mushroom thing? <laughs> Am I poisoning myself or something? What's that mushroom thing? I don't even know what that means. There's no quests in here. Fine. I'll go find another spot to quest in. They coming for me? Hard to tell. Maybe I can use this rock. You guys going to attack me or not? You going to bite me? Would be funny if they just waited to be three before they attack me. <laughs> He's like, hi, mom. <laughs> oh, my God. It's like all the freshwater locations are at zero percent. 
the last freshwater location I was at was at 0%. This is ridiculous, devs. And refilling it takes forever. Like, it needs, to, it needs to refill itself a little bit faster. Otherwise, it just makes me want to log out and log back on to a different server. That's, that's all it makes me want to do. So, you got to work on that. Okay, so let's take a moment to discuss this right here. Over the course of growing my Spino and Gondwa, I came across this issue several times and I feel like there were several very bad design choices surrounding the water quality in this game and those bad design choices are all the more obvious in Gondwa. Basically in Gondwa, it takes a long time to drain a body of water, but once it's dry, it stays dry until the servers restart. I actually ended up logging out completely and relogging in several times when coming across this issue just so that the game would put me on a server that had fresh water. My suggestion is to get the rain involved in this. I think that every time it rains, the water should regain some quality. If only for the sake of letting the players know that they won't have to wait until a server restart to be able to drink again. It doesn't rain very often in Gondwa, so this wouldn't be too OP, and you could make it so that the water regenerates at a rate of 1% for every minute of rain. So if it rains for 20 minutes, then all bodies of water regenerate by 20%. Since we can be a long time without rain in Gondwa, we're still going to find ourselves struggling for a drink of water here and there, but it won't be to the point of forcing people to log out and log back into a different server. The replenish quests in this game, in my personal opinion, are a joke and a complete waste of time. If you're looking to farm marks, then sure, go ahead, work on it, but other than that, it's just in the way and you can't complete it. If 7 clams only got me 1% at Big Quill Lake, this means I could work on that quest non-stop until the servers reset and it wouldn't even be done with it. And there's nothing more annoying than to see this quest pop up when you're trying to complete the regular quests because you know you can't finish it. So your only option at that point is to get out of the zone, wait four long minutes, and come back in and hope to get a different one. Again, extremely poor design choices. My suggestion with this one is to make it a side quest. The same as you did with the Hunt Critters quest and the Hunt Herbivore quest. Let it be on at the same time as the regular quest so that people who want to work on it can do that. But if you're like me and want nothing to do with it, because it's just nonsense, <laughs> then you can simply complete the regular quests and move on to the next zone and never be bothered by the replenish quests ever again. Same goes with the Waystone replenish quests. So that was my rant about the water nonsense in Gondwa. Please share your thoughts in the comments. Rant over. Moving on. Yep, zero percent. Messing around with the different skins and color patterns. And uh, out of the ones that I can actually buy, because I only have 2,000 marks, out of what I can actually buy, I think this is this is the the best looking one. Something walking somewhere. Yeah, right there. There's a something chasing something else. Suko chasing a Pikno. You gonna come for me? Uh, <laughs> he's getting his stem. I might die right there because that Suko looks bigger than me. And the water is not gonna help me. I think he is going to come for me. Maybe not.
Billy, man. Why'd you guys team up on me? <laughs> I mean, I was fine fighting that croc. I was fine fighting the Suko. Why did they have to team up on me? I know for a fact I was I was gonna win that fight against that Sarko. No doubt in my mind I was gonna win that fight. Something fighting a Meg. Yeah, that Meg is about to die. There's something else coming up. There's a croc somewhere. Can't really tell where he is. I probably could have saved that uh, that Meg, but then again, Megs are uh, <laughs> they're backstabbing little pieces of shits. <laughs> I would bet. A thousand dollars, that guy never expected that. <laughs> oh my god, that's just funny. Can you imagine swimming across the water like that and then that, that spino that's bigger than you just pops out the water? I could have killed him right there, but I don't have to find food quest. If I did, I would have killed him. I would have jumped on that opportunity 100%. <sighs> All I'm hoping is that there isn't like a, some huge croc in here. I don't care if there are crocs, just not adult ones. Ah oh, shit, look at that. Two huge crocs just drinking over there. Dang it, I can't quest here. Glad they were out of the water. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely not safe for me to go there. Definitely not safe. That's two. I just stopped recording and then that thing came after me. I can't take on two, there's just no way.
Why are you blocking me? I guess going back to the water is not an option. I have no idea if I can even take on one of these. But yeah, I had just stopped recording. I don't know if it's the pick nose hunting the Rex or the Rex hunting the pick nose. I think it's the pick nose hunting the Rex. Got your back, buddy. broken here Glad the packy's dead. That's starting to hurt.
too tough to kill these things. I can't kill it. Now that Rex is pretty much on his own now. I tried, buddy. Can't save you now. Is it the Rex still? Underwater? Rex is there. Okay, that that little crog is stupid. That Anno really wants that Rex. That poor Rex can't do anything. The moment he gets up to land, that Anno's on him. half health and I can't do anything against that guy. That poor Rex, he doesn't stand a chance. The moment he gets up on land, that thing is on him. The Rex can't do anything. He's about to drown and I can't help him. hurting me too much. So I'm not an adult. I'm not even sub. <laughs> I need to go heal. So I'm gonna go keep working on that quest of mine. Oh, Rex is still alive. Oh, there's a bigger Rex now. Why is he not helping? Why is that big Rex not helping the small Rex? If that big Rex decides to help, I will jump back in. I guess he doesn't want to. <laughs> if 
we all team up against it, we have a chance. That big Rex doesn't want to do shit. another one. There's two now. Okay, do that. I'm out. It's the Meg. Oh yeah. I'm sub now. How did the Anno get there? Shit, I fell. <laughs> That truck is just gonna watch from a distance, I guess. Can't get up there. Falls in the water, he's done. I'm not sure of it. The other one, the one, uh, the one we fought earlier was white. Ow! So his timing is pretty good.
Can't afford to get hit like that too much. doesn't even look bloody. The amount of bites I got on him? I don't know, man. I'm not hurting him. Why is he even here, though? I really hope he goes in the water. in the water plus he's gonna sink is that that venom is keeping him that venom is keeping him from uh, getting his stamp back I was hoping that, you know, the amount of bites I got on him in the water, like, what the hell? Are they healing fast too? Like, is that a thing? Oof. Okay, now I'm too hurt to keep going. I'm just waiting for the find food quest so I can feed and then heal. <laughs>
shit. It got to land. I wasn't there. I should have been there. I don't have enough HP. If he wants to fight me, well, he's gonna die. I can't chase. <laughs> I think that's the only reason why they attack me is because they know I can't chase. They know they can escape when they want to. I really want to put a bleed on him. That would be epic. One bleed on that guy. He's dead. really still laying down up here. Oh yeah, got the bleed. <laughs>
I mean, to be honest, that fight isn't fair for them, but it's still 2v1. I mean... I'm not letting you sit. You need to bleed it out. <laughs> Got that one as well. Did I get him again? I don't know. Now I got him. I think. What am I hearing? Oh, that's another, uh, two other Spinos. Oh, Stego over there. What is he doing? Why would you come close to me like that? Unless you plan on fighting. Oh, there's another big spino in the water. I think it's big anyway. If it is, I might be in trouble. <laughs> I need to heal. That's one thing for sure I need to heal. I think I saw the big spino attacking the small one. I want to go help him, but I need to heal. I wish I didn't attack that Stego. Why am I not... That Spino is just KOSing all the other Spinos. I'm back at that same lake again. The lake where the other Spino killed me. I really wish I hadn't fought that Stegosaurus because when I saw that big Spino attack the smaller Spino, I 100% would have gone to help him. swinging your tail at me like that. That's... He 
he was coming for me. 100% sure he was coming for me. Coming or not, he just chases me when I'm turning my back to him. If I'm facing him, he's just being a wimp. What are you doing, man? You're annoying the crap out of me, dude. Stop following me if you don't want to fight. Look at him. Huh. Okay, good job, guys. <laughs> okay, there's a lot, a lot of people here. Looks like. might be the same people that killed me earlier. Looks like the same Rex and the same Aloe. I don't know what these corpses are. Well, if that Aloe wants to take me on again, 
I'm okay with it. Wow, the amount of stuff that's dead here. The Rex is all the way over there, so why not? You coming? Guess not. Pretty sure that's the same dude. No way these guys killed these two Rexes. No way. Oh, there's another Spino in the water. Just saw him. Just saw him dive. So he swam past me, didn't attack me. Yeah, he looks pretty big. It's a Suko. Oh no, that's the Spino. coming. Let's see. Would be interesting if that Aloe and Rex could team up on the, the green Spino. I would love to see that because then I would jump in and help him. I wonder what's gonna happen here. The Aloe and the Rex. Oh yeah. I got the aloe, man. Aloe's underwater now. Take that. That could be the same Rex that attacked me before, but I'm not in <laughs> not in good shape enough to fight now. <laughs> that was really cool. Really cool. Cause I called it. That looks like two aloes. They're going up where I want to go. Suko there. Maybe me and the Suko can take those aloes. Never mind. Come on, Suko. I thought it was going to be a 1v2 or a 2v2, not a 1v3, to be honest. Ah, oh, shit. Another Suko right there. Is he friends with 
though. There he is. Uh, if I was full health, I would have attacked him, but I'm not. I'm way too close to dead. big spino in this lake. I just saw him dive in front of me. Oh shit. turning and not me. him a lot. Where is he? Now I just want to finish him. That's two aloes or... Same guys I fought earlier. I don't think I've <laughs> I've wanted something dead so bad. Kinda wish I could have killed that Suko too though. I've gone around the lake like four times now. Maybe more. Haven't seen him again. Oh, there he is. That's gotta be the same one. same sail anyway. So far I've encountered two spinos that were bigger than me with a sail like that one and both of them attacked me without provocation so I have something against speed spinos.
basically waiting for him to get in the water. <laughs> Patience might pay off. He looks exactly like the one who attacked me. I've rewatched the footage. I have the video right next to me. The video of him attacking me. He looks identical to that. Yeah, that's him. I'm, I'm looking at him right now. It's gotta be him. Same colors and everything. Same sail, same colors. him. He's just got the speed advantage. Only one because the T-Rex, the T-Rex freaking broke my bones and damaged me like crazy. This is very frustrating <laughs> right now. got back to Big Quill and I saw another defense uh, Spino. Yeah, he's right there. Let's see what he does. I think we can be friends. I think I might be a little bit bigger than him. Yeah, I think I am.
Exactly, you're defending him. I heard him. And you know what? They're making it easy on me. I can just swim all the way back there. That Rex isn't very smart. <laughs> He's so young. Well, probably adolescent. But like, I was swimming behind him. I literally did this to let him know I was here. And he still came in the water. Like that, that would have been such an easy kill right there. Something's attacking the Rex. Come on Rex, just do something. Oh my God. He didn't even try to... Uh. Okay, well, he kind of deserved to die. <laughs> I wanted to come and help him, but he kind of deserved to die, to be honest. It. That should turn me into an adult. Or maybe not. Oh yeah, it did. Just two seconds to spare. Guess I'm just gonna be the big, the king of Big Quill. Kids. All right, guys, sadly, there were no epic encounters after becoming an adult. I played as an adult for a few hours and have not come across any worthy opponents, but I'm hoping that the action I got as a sub adult was good enough to satisfy you all. I probably will play my Spino again in the future and hopefully when I do, I'll get some good fights as an adult. Now about Gondwa, I'm just gonna say I absolutely love the map and I'm excited to come back in it uh, with my next dino, but they have got to do something about the freshwater problem. I really hope that they eventually make the rain help with water quality and I really, really hope that the replenish water quests and replenish waystone quests become side quests that can be active at the same time as a regular quest so that they stop taking the place of a regular quest. So this marks the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Share your thoughts in the comments. All feedback is welcome. You guys take care and I will see you all soon. Bye bye.